This is a bench test of the Pentair Superflow Variable Speed Pump, where we'll, we will be running this pump with a 2 inch suction line and an inch and a half return line, and we'll, we will be monitoring the flow rate, RPM, and electrical consumption under these conditions. Let's go ahead and get started here. Pump is already running, 750 RPM. Electrical consumption at that rate is 0.9 amps. 91 watts flow rate under this condition just about 13 gallons per minute thousand rpm just over one amp 1.03 amps 134 watts seeing about 16 16 and a half gallons per minute to 1.18 amps, 190 watts. Now over on our high range flow meter, we can see about 27 gallons per minute. One point four three amps, two hundred and sixty nine watts, two hundred and sixty eight watts. It's about thirty five gallons per minute. One point eight two amps, three hundred and seventy five watts. That's about forty two gallons per minute. Two point three eight amps, five hundred and fifteen watts. It's about forty eight gallons per minute. Three point one one amps, six hundred and ninety seven watts. That's just about sixty gallons per minute. Just over four amps, 914 watts. Over 60 gallons per minute now, about 63 gallons per minute. Five 
5.2 amps, 1.19 kilowatts or 1,190 watts. Just about 70 gallons a minute. Six point five four amps, one point five kilowatts. about 77 77 gallons per minute eight point one six amps one point eight seven kilowatts Now in excess of 80 gallons per minute, about 83 gallons per minute. And this is maximum speed. Nine point seven seven amps, two point two five kilowatts. It's under 90 gallons per minute. I would call that about 88 gallons per minute. As a reminder, this has been a bench test using a single two inch suction line, a single inch and a half discharge line, and installed with a 240 volt electrical service. If you found this information helpful, please be sure to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And you can check out my website, swimmingpoolsteve.com.